My name is Neve Anandaraja, and I'm a mechanical engineer for alloy product development. Me specifically, I work with the 3D geometry and the design. So this product is the one that I most recently worked on. It's the new studio headphone by Beats by Dre. After the concept generation, we figure out exactly what's the best way to put that together that achieves all of these constraints that we have. One thing that we always talk about is, is how's it gonna look like when it's on the head? With this headband alone, I've probably made you know, 30 different prototypes. And then in terms of just like on my computer, how many different versions, it's hundreds. I don't even wanna you know, think about it. The application that we use the most is CAD computer-aided design. So it's like creating 3D geometry on your computer then taking these prototypes, testing them, breaking them, figuring out where their faults are, we iterate and do more prototypes. So this phase sort of constantly goes throughout almost the entire development cycle until you've completely finalized the product. What I have to do is just sort of go in here and then modify these parts by hands. I know a lot of people here like bike riding and skateboarding and stuff like that and connecting the physics to you know that actual hobby that you have gets you excited to learn. In high school, you know, I'd, I'd like to, to tinker with stuff, you know, do some soldering and a little bit of woodworking here and there. Throughout college, I didn't know exactly what in mechanical engineering I wanted to do. But you know, I found myself drawn towards user experience and sort of the design process because of the creativity. I did an internship, which I found was too large of a, of a company. And then I did an internship at a small design firm, which was like two people. And then this is sort of where I came after school, which was uh, like a 20 person consultancy, where it's small enough where everyone has a say and it's a flat hierarchy. So it doesn't feel like you're trying to climb a corporate ladder, but at the same time, there's lots of people that you can learn from and get inspired from. You know, I actually got this job by going door to door and knocking on every single door and uh, you know, just slipping my portfolio under the door until you know, someone finally gave me an interview. Through persistence and constantly trying, you know, I got an internship which turned into a full-time hire, which turned into a really great relationship. You know, four years later, this is where I'm at.